Hey, hey, y'all. It's Michelle from Monkey's Creations. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Come on in. Let me just find you real quick. There you be. What's up? Hey, hey. So I was playing, <laughs> as I usually do. Why is it not? Hold on, y'all. Something's not working right, of course. All right, let me just go all the way out. Hello, hello. Sorry, y'all. But I gotta be able to see your comments. There we go. How were you been, Karen? <laughs> Am I on the right live? I hope so. Oh, well. All right. It looks like we're good now. I've got your comments. So, I was playing, and I love Talavera Pottery. So I have a bunch of pots. Um, so I was just kind of playing with flowers because I do love pops of color as well. Um, so how many of y'all thought those were real flowers? Be honest. Give me a thumbs up if you thought those were real flowers. Because they weren't. <laughs> they are plastic flowers from Amazon and I just love the colors so <laughs> there are quite a few of you but they're not y'all they're plastic flowers from Amazon um, and they are called turn me on I did not come up with that name I swear but if you pull up Amazon and put in all one word turn me on these will pop up I promise you <laughs> So, I'm going to do some, I have some hangers um, that I do in the front um, on each side of the house on the, um, the trees. Um, so, I just thought I would do those as well and give the front yard a little bit of color before our party tomorrow. Um, so, these come in all different colors as you can see. Um, so... I took one of each color and I literally just pulled it apart. Hello. Just bring each of those stems out a little bit. Just like that. I know, right, Charlotte? <laughs> Look, I am not above it. This was way cheaper than buying fa uh, real flowers that I'm going to kill anyway. Right? So, y'all just don't tell my neighbors they're fake. You have them? Now, I did get another variety. They'll be here tomorrow, but I'm going to do something else with those. Hello from Arizona. But aren't they pretty? I just love them. And they are UV resistant. So that definitely helps. 
So the ones in the Talabera pottery in my backyard was, I just kind of stuck them in dirt um, because I didn't know if I'd like it, but I do love it. So I am going to empty them and put them in styrofoam and redo those. Um, I <laughs> know that just means I watered them really well, Dana. <laughs> yes. So once I get them all kind of bushy out, all I do was literally just put the ends together, kind of shake it, and look. Like you can't get much simpler than that. Right. So spread it apart, put another one in. <laughs> Look, oh my God, I'm loving this. They're called Turn Me On. <laughs> I did not come up with that name, I swear. <laughs> and they are wired, so you can move them around. Dirt, exactly. <laughs> and then I just zip tied the ends. Yes, I got some more I'm going to do in a wreath tomorrow. Well, depending on what time my order gets here. It's the same variety, but it doesn't have the long, the long leaves like these. Okay, so then I just glued a styrofoam ball in the middle, and I'm just going to put some glue in it. And stick it right down in there. Now everything is wired so it can all be fixed. Just like that. No, don't do don't do that on Facebook. You might get booted. <laughs> you might get booted. Don't do it. Okay? And then I've got, I cut up some more so that we could fill in at the bottom. So as you can see, some of that purple didn't get over, so I'm going to bring the purple over here. And just kind of fill in this ball. Hello, hello. Until we can't see. Well, I don't care if you can see it like looking down, but I don't want you to be able to see it from the side and be able to see the ball. for the stars. Bring some white over here. Gosh darn it, no, we didn't do the Friday dance. Everybody up, get off the couch, get out of the bed. Get off the chair. If you're eating, I'm jelly. Stay where you're at and just dance in your chair. You ready? It's Friday. It's Friday. It's Friday. <laughs> yeah, the styrofoam will hold up. I know. 
Oh, isn't it cute? I just love it. Yep, you can paint the bow green for sure. I know, I love it in my pottery too. Now I will redo that because those are just kind of stuck in dirt right now. could definitely use moss for sure. I know, isn't it cute? And it's wired, so I'm going to have some kind of draping over the side. At the gym this morning. To, oh, you did? <laughs> so I put one bundle of each in the center, and then I cut up... I believe uh, two bundles of each. So see, I'm just kind of giving that a little curl. So that we have some kind of hanging over the side. Probably should have cut these stems down just a little bit, but that's all right. We are going to make it work. I know, Pam. Y'all know I don't work with florals much. Actually, hardly any, but I've been doing quite a bit lately. I'm like, oh my gosh, what's wrong with me? <laughs> What's wrong with me? There was just kind of a gap, so it's wired. I just brought them back in. Oh. Burn my thumb. You have to put all one word. Turn me on. She keeps giving away. you it'll pop up and I probably will add some moss to this Let's see, we need some of this 
this right there. You love that pot? That's um, called Talavera Pottery. So it's Mexican pottery. And I love it. It is kind of pricey. So I only get one new piece a year. That's my my spring luxury item. <laughs> so I do that once a year. Let's see, we need some purple. Isn't it cute? And so fun. And it won't die, y'all. Texas, y'all, I, so our winters have been really cold the last couple years, so it's literally been killing everything I plant, so I'm like, mm -mm, I'm over it, and then when I got these, I was like, that's what I'm doing, How many of each color is just going to vary for your taste? Um, I used one of each in the main part of it. And now I'm just filling in. So if you don't want to use as many flowers, add some moss around the base. to hang down a little bit. They're from Amazon. I live in West Virginia, so any potted plants you have to purchase every year. Yeah. Well, this year out front, instead of regular flowers, I'm just doing foxtail fern. And those are hardy to to cold weather so I was like I'm, I'm done but I can add these all day long so you're gonna kill it and you're gonna make a unicorn clock yay It's coming together. Need a white piece right there. No, you can't, and it really didn't take that much um, to hide it. What color do I need there? I, think I need one of these. No, don't tell them they're fake, y'all. If you know my neighbors, don't tell them it's fake. <laughs> don't tell them. It'll be our secret. Near the foxtail? We have foxtail in our backyard. It doesn't bother them.
These are from Amazon. These are small. Let's just put these together. Pretend to water them, right? <laughs> Oh my god, you're all cracking me up. Oh my goodness, come on. Really? Oh, now it gushes out. I think it looks awesome. I think I'm just going to add a few more into the top and then just add moss around the bottom. Since I have some extra. Never know they were fake, would you? We've got a hole right here, nothing but green. Let's fill that hole in. And then we'll call this one done. have to touch them to see. Yes, you would. There. Then we can just kind of fluff them out. Let me grab that moss. And we will cover up that base. I really don't think you can see it. But you may be able to. I mean, I could keep adding flowers. Oh my goodness, come on, glue gun. Like miniature roses or double petunias, I th I just love them. Y'all, I don't I don't know flowers, so I mean I've heard of a petunia, but do I know what it looks like? Probably not. Oh, y'all, I'm about to cuss. 
I just bought this glue gun too. y'all. Pretty that is. <sighs> I love it. Let's see if we can bring these up. These pots I got from Amazon as well, but I got these last year. Probably should have just taken this off. But we we'll get her. We we'll get it. go y'all look how pretty give me one <laughs> so how many bundles I used <coughs> I have five colors so that's already five. And then I cut two bundles of each to fill in. So each bundle had, I believe, seven. So, I mean, I can count one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So that's two bundles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's three bundles we didn't use. And just three pieces left. So I did ten bundles cut up, and we didn't use three of them. So that's seven. So seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve bundles is what I used approximately. 12 bundles is what I used on there. Do you have the switch on the glue gun set? Yes. I generally have mine on high um, unless I'm working with the pool noodles or something that's going to show the little indent. Then I put it on low um, because those seem to um, burn a little bit more than the styrofoam. 
So that's about the only time I'll put my glue gun on low temp. But isn't that awesome? And you can add more if you wanted. But I think I like it just the way it is. And it'll look good in my trees. And I don't have to water them. It can't get much better than that. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I do have one more to make, but I will let y'all go. Um, because I'm sure y'all don't want to sit here and watch me make another one. Um, but that is it. I probably will not see y'all this weekend. Um, but we'll have to see. Have to see. I think the party starts at 1 tomorrow. So I'll be cleaning the rest of today until people start showing up tomorrow. <laughs> so uh, one per basket or a little less actually you can get a basket no you really can't and then you got to water them all the time and I think so one bundle um, so like one bundle of one packet I mean let me think one packet of these comes in a bundle of 20 so you get 20 of these um, for $35. So that's not bad at all. Now I got all the individual colors, but they do have multicolored. Um, so if you just get the multicolored, you would just need one bundle. Um, but these come in a bundle of 20. So you get 20 of these stems for like $35. So really that's not bad at all. And it won't die. It's UV resistant, so you can't beat that. Um Yeah, and they look real from afar. They actually look kind of real up front, up close, don't they? So, all right y'all, that's all I got for y'all. Have an awesome weekend. Happy Mother's Day to all of y'all amazing women. I'll still be posting. I'll, sh I'll show you pics and stuff from our crawfish bowl tomorrow, but um, y'all have an awesome weekend. Bye, y'all.